Alright guys, so melanin series, melanin series. So there are three types of melanin um on earth. You get to me? I said there are more different there are more types of melanin you know, guys. Melanin var have, have many variations and stuff, but there are three main types of melanin where them identify in the human consciousness and in other plants and animals and stuff. Well on earth, on the earthly plane. On the earthly plane. You have neuromelanin. Which is the melanin that is found throughout the nervous system, the central nervous system, meaning that it's found um, in the brain, uh, just throughout the central nervous system overall. You get to me, I say throughout the nervous system. If you understand the nervous system of the human body, you understand the brain and the spinal cord and all the nerves and neurons connected. So, neuromelanin is found throughout the nervous system. This is the most potent form of melanin, the most powerful form of melanin known to mankind. And you have Pheomelanin now. Pheomelanin is a uh, pheomelanin. Pheo, it's spelled with P-H. Pheo, pheomelanin or pheomelanin. It's a reddish, a reddish brown type of melanin. It's more red. So you see the redded people in the world, people who you see have red hair like the Irish people them. Yeah man, the Celtic redded people them. Yeah man, them possess a, a heavy amount of pheomelanin. That's why you see them here come out red. You get to me, I say the type of melanin we have to affect the, your ear color and your eye color. You know, so most melanated people possess, um, yeah, guys, um, the people that possess a lot of fair melanin in their skin, you know, they have like bland ear or reddish, reddish brown ear or the deep red, like where you see the red them look. You get to me, I say, and then you have you melanin now. You melanin is the most common type of melanin. It's found in the fruit, it's found in the plants. It's found um, on the certain in the human skin, and, and the pigment, the pigmented one, the brown pigmented one. Uh, it made the surface of our skin look so. You know, it's the most common, it's the most abundant type of melanin. But as I say, neuromelanin is the most potent, and neuromelanin is more black. You get to me, still like your ear black, and neuromelanin make your ear so black. You see, in comparison to the U melanin, where make your skin brown, U melanin have a brown brown color like you see my skin brown but then you see how my hair black because the neuromelanin make me hair so black it come from out of the nervous system so throughout the nervous system you have that black that super black type of melanin here so you find out that the black of the melanin are the most potent it is you see what i say so that shows you that you know there's power in blackness you know there's power in melanin there's power in carbon and carbon is the basis of melanin and carbon is also the basis of all single with every single life form Every single e life in existence, carbon is the base of that. You see, you see them have carbon dating and them type of thing where you can use the amount of carbon in the being to decide how long you used to live and them type of something. There. So carbon is the basis of life. 